criticize it. It's just me being me. That's that's all it is. If a guy would have made that video like D'Angelo does a video where he's pretty much naked, you don't know what's going on below that scene or, or who's with him, but <laughs> you know, and then um, Ricky Martin, it's not controversial at all to see him pulling hot wax down a naked female, you know. If I want to at 21, just like, you know, any other person, you know, wear a short skirt if I want to or... No or, skirt. I think it scares. And this song is definitely about the vulnerability you go through if you've ever been discriminated against or um, unaccepted by a certain group of people. Every day is so wonderful. Make peace with my own past mm -hmm. and make me feel like I can have a fresh start in incorporating peace and safety and having a safe haven for my son and my family that I was never able to have growing up. And it's, it's so emotionally and psychologically damaging, it sticks with you. You know, years later, the bruises have faded, but you know, in my head, I, I still hear the echoes of it. She recorded the song in one take, laying on the floor of the studio would be one of the few female artists to openly criticize Eminem for anti-woman lyrics, a charge he would quickly counter in a song and prove true at the same time. I think he, he gets up there and uh, uh, does a lot of what he thinks is going to be shocking just for the shock value. Hey everyone, I'm challenging you to pass the red cup for World Hunger Relief. Donate $5 and help feed 20 children. Pass it on.
is, is so important. Um, I was approached by Yum Brands, who partners with the World Food Program in the UN, to help provide food and nutrition as meals. <laughs> It's heartbreaking that nearly 800 million people, many of whom are children, go to bed hungry each night. As a mom of two, I'm passionate about this issue and want to inspire people to donate to young It's her desire to help others. Christina has been on the front lines of many great organizations and is a leader in the Rock the Vote campaign. But the cause that she believes in most passionately is the fight to feed the world's starving children. Traveling to Haiti and Guatemala on relief trips, she has served as the global spokesperson for Yum Brand's world hunger relief efforts since 2009. In recognition of all her hard A very special and unique performer. For those of us who are musicians, we are in awe of her pure talent. As Americans, we are inspired by all that she gives to help those in need wherever they live. And as Latinos, we are so proud to see how she has become a role model, not just for our entire community, but for anyone who aspires to make this world a better place. It was